words can sound half as sweet. See if what? Now, wait, just look. Sharia, I came to ask if you would be the leader of our relief organization. Uh, of course, I would try to help however I could, so, uh, will you consider it? I'm sorry. But I've had a lot of time to think recently, and I've learned what I truly want from my life. And unfortunately, that means I have to turn you both down. I'm sorry. I suppose it would be rude to ask what it is that you truly want. Mm, I'm sorry. Come on, Raymond. Let's go. You embark on a great quest tomorrow, Sharia. You should get some rest. Thank you, Bailey. Take care of her, Asbel. Hey! How long have you been standing there? You're enslaving poor Raymond now? Hey, stop that! <laughs> Sorry. So, hey, mind if I ask what you truly want? Whatever it is, I'd like to help. Asbel. What about you? What are you going to do when this is over? I want to help Lon get back to normal. And I suppose I'll need to help Sophie. She's had nothing but painful memories her whole life. And now her home is gone on top of it. So I was thinking maybe she could just live here in Lont. Then maybe I could, I don't know, give her some happy memories? You said something like that before, right? About how you'd either help her get home, or be with her for the rest of your life. Huh? Uh, yeah. I guess I did say that. But that was a long time ago. And I've learned it's not something I can do on my own. That's why. Look, I... I was thinking about continuing the relief work I was doing before. I want to travel the world and help those less fortunate than I. I see. You really are an angel, Sharia. Stop it. All these selfless acts are gonna make me look bad. You know that, right? Just take care of Sophie. Otherwise, I can't be held responsible for what happens. I will. I promise. So, I need to get some sleep. See you tomorrow. Someone's late? Sorry, I didn't realize everyone else was here. You slept okay? We should get going. Look. They've come to see us off. Please be careful, all of you. And don't worry about us. We'll be fine. We shall humbly wait your return. Good luck, everyone. We'll be praying for your safety. Do what you must and then get back here. And don't you dare die on me. Travel well, young masters. Thanks, everyone. All right, we're off to the Lostalia. Thank you. 
We believe that Lambda and King Richard have traveled deep into Aphinia's core. Then let's take the shuttle to the world's eye and find them! You're probably tired of hearing this, but we must risk all, including our lives, in the upcoming battle. I hope you are truly prepared. The fate of Aphinia rests in our hands. It's kind of terrifying to think about. But you don't have your scared face, Sharia. That's because I'll be facing it with all of you. All right, I think we're all finished with preparations. Now, let's do this. Yeah! Right. Wait, hold on! Ugh, come on, Hubert. The Oswell family vault is located somewhere in the Stratton Desert. It is possible that its contents might prove useful in the upcoming battle. Where exactly is it? I don't know its exact location, but if we use the shuttle to make a meticulous search, we might well stumble upon it. All right, and if anyone has any other places they want to check, we'd better do it now. This is the way to the Lostalia. And this is our last chance to make things right. You said going down here would be like entering Lambda himself, yeah? We can't worry about that now. We'll simply have to face whatever is waiting for us. Sophie shared her power. Now all that's left is for us to trust each other. this is the ruins on the surface continue all the way down so my theory was right I saw some documents on Fodra that outlined a big plan for moving the Lestalia moving the Lestalia they wanted the core of our world nope the exact opposite I think the Amarsian predecessors moved the Lestalia out of Fodra and into Aphinia I see then this would be the area they used to transport it probably
Expect the best from everyone! Oh, death by moonlight! Enter the abyss! 